and he's looking down at me and saying, with that GPA, you have a bad game plan and you really should just drop out and go home. And I'm sitting here thinking, I have like one quarter left. I've invested four and a half years in these two degrees and he's telling me to go home. I did not expect a black person who understood the magnitude of my journey and what I wanted to do to treat me like that. And so it was devastating. Well, I started crying, obviously. And when I didn't turn and leave, he picked up the phone and made one phone call and got me enough financial aid to get me to graduation. I never forgot that life-changing conversation with that man. It made me bitter, it made me angry, but it did not make me quit. It made me purpose to prove him wrong. And because of that, when I graduated from Georgia Tech, I sent him an invitation. I don't remember his name. I never will probably, but I do remember how he made me feel. And that's why I have a poster of Maya Angelou behind my desk at work that says, people may forget what you said, People may forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made me make them feel. And so that can go both ways. That could be good or bad. In his case, he put a battery in my back. And so I knew with my 2.5 GPA, it was going to be very, very difficult for me to become an engineering professor. And I was broke, had no money. So I had to go and work as an engineer for several years to pay my student loans back. And then I could actually pursue my graduate degree to do the thing I always wanted to do. And the fact that I didn't know a lot about how difficult the journey was for black women in STEM, or the fact that it was a completely unrealistic dream to have with my GPA, um, or that the experiences were not always gonna be so positive is probably what kept me going. So I like to say if there had not been a Spelman College to build me up, I probably would not have my degree or my PhD um, in engineering. So come back for the next part to learn more about my after undergrad journey to STEM. Stay STEMtastic.